Subglottic hemangioma is a benign vascular tumor that is initiated usually during the first few weeks to month of the life. It forms a large mass in the airway below the vocal cords and may cause varying degrees of airway obstruction. In most of cases, it grows rapidly over 12 to 80 months. Then the lesion stabilizes in size for a while. Finally, the lesion resolves spontaneously in almost half of cases. However, in some cases, the mass will not shrink completely and it may require intervention because of its life-threatening nature. In this video, you can see a 4-month old baby who brought to emergency department with respiratory distress and a strider. The doctors diagnosed Crook for him at the first step. Treatment with intravenous epinephrine and prednisolone started for him. His symptoms started again when taking corticosteroid was discontinued for him. The bronchoscopy was performed for him. As you can see in the video, there is a large hemangioma in the subglottic area that has nearly obstructed the airway. After 10 months of continuous treatment, the symptoms improved and the patient underwent bronchoscopy again to evaluate the response to therapy. Here is the second bronchoscopy video. As you can see, the hemangioma has completely shrunk and almost nothing can be seen. It was a dramatical response.